With less than a month before its official launch, the animated feature film War of the Worlds Goliath is already making waves here in Malaysia and elsewhere around the world. The brainchild of Malaysian production house Tripod Films, Goliath is the first local production to be featured at the Los Angeles 3D Film Festival. Goliath was also screened at the San Diego Comic Convention in July and more recently in Barcelona. Goliath, Malaysia's first 3D stereoscopic animated film, beat out other industry staples such as DreamWorks Madagascar 3 in the competition. But Malaysians shouldn't be too surprised at the win, says Tripod's CEO, Leon Tan. He says that Malaysians are generally talented in the animation field, but lack opportunities at home to further develop and channel their raw talent. Goliath, which looks like it may be a winner given its critical reception, will help spur the industry, Leon says, and spark the development of other nascent technical areas. In this interview with Business Circle, Leon talks about some of the industry issues behind the making of Goliath and the development of the sector in the future. Goliath will be released in Malaysia on November 15th. There's a lot of talent here and a lot of it's world class. It's just that there's never been uh, real opportunities to have many uh, interesting projects and projects that are sustainable and recurring that would allow uh, our talent to be further developed uh, for the global stage. That said, however, um, collaboration is key in our, in our industry to uh, upskill each other because just as much as we need skills, so do they. I think if I had a chance to uh, redo Goliath, knowing what we know today and seeing the development on the industry and the development of the skill sets that we've uh, built along the way of production, I think it would be possible for us to do Goliath 100% in Malaysia. The reason why we use Sunmin was that 2D cell animation um, is still in its infancy in Malaysia and we needed that uh, as part of the requirement to bring War of the Worlds Goliath to life. Malaysian companies uh, like ours working with Korean companies, we learned a lot. Uh, we even sent the Malaysian team over to, to train under them and the results were fantastic. I think the issue isn't so much whether we have talent, because we do. The issue is how do you harness it and a lot of it has to do with education and after, after the education is done and, and you, you, you get your degree and you move out of the classroom, what happens next? I think it's important for us to work as an industry to allow for opportunities for our talents to grow in that manner. I think when we started out making War of the Worlds Goliath, the first question we asked was, what kind of product did we want? The answer that we gave ourselves was that we wanted uh, audiences from around the world to be able to watch it and enjoy it. And it didn't matter whether it was uh, in, in North America or in Europe or in Asia or Africa or anywhere else. The end result so far has led us to some pretty amazing places we never considered. I think the, the hard part for, for Goliath was uh, the fact that the, uh, the, the market changed so drastically and sometimes they change in a matter of months. We started out uh, 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 conceptualizing Goliath as a DVD, straight to DVD movie at a time where DVD market was booming. And in a short, uh, within you know, uh, 12 to 18 months, the DVD market practically went away. So we had to continuously f uh, f find ways to adapt and keep the production going. So we decided to, to make it more cinematic and we raised funds for that. And a few months later, we decided to go stereoscopic. And, and these were all challenges, both in terms of raising funds and production, but I think in the end, it was worth it. I think it's important that we should look at creating more content for Goliath in the cinematic scope that we've done before. And sometimes these transmedia uh, opportunities allow us to build a large customer base and a large fan base that justifies the need to make another film and to tell the story of Goliath further on. Because at the end of the day, we are telling stories. That's why we're in this industry. The, the challenge is to tell stories and package them into, into products that can be consumed by an audience because at the end of the day, it's still a business. In the case of production, we have uh, many uh, mechanisms to protect ourselves as we, uh, as we go into production and developing intellectual property. Make sure that we protect our IP legally. Make sure we have things like errors and emissions insurance. Make sure that uh, we hire the right people and, and get involved with the right partners and do a lot of due diligence. The same kind of due diligence you put in a company, apply that kind of uh, focus on projects on IP, on partners, and uh, these are universal, really these are universal skills. And perhaps um, 
our industry needs more of this. Music